Hey, what's up? So, I used to hold a pick like this. Just looks like three fingers. Like, almost inverted, basically, as I'm picking. It's pretty cool, right? No, it's not. Not at all. So, I was like probably 15 when someone first told me that's probably not the best way to pick. And uh, he basically said that I can develop wrist problems if I did that. So I was like, okay, maybe I should switch. The other thing was I really wanted a sweet pick. And I realized that I could go down pretty well sweet picking like that. But going up was really weird. I had to switch my whole freaking the direction of my hand. It's not the easiest thing. Um, and so I tried to learn how to do it the correct way. And I actually failed again. So I tried to hold it with uh, two fingers, like this, my fingertips. So the thing that was good was that now I was just using two fingers instead of three fingers, but I was using my fingertips, which is not good. You don't want to use your fingertips because the pick can slip out very easily. It's uh, You don't have a very good grip when you're just using your fingertips to hold the pick. Um, and so it wasn't until I was 25 that... I actually got a guitar teacher finally and he taught me how to uh, hold the pick imagine that and this is the way that like any guitar teacher will tell you how to hold a pick for really good reasons so basically what you want to do is if you just can see that you have your hand like that the pick is gonna come up right in there like right at the first knuckle of your index finger <laughs> hands at a very awkward position right now but you kind of get the idea it's just like that it's really simple but it's very very effective and so that way it's going to be level to the guitar so it's not like <laughs> like that that's not very cool um yeah it's going to be level and you're going to find that you'll be able to play so many different things that's what I found. It's it's just so versatile. I can play all these different things. I can do all the sweep picking stuff that I wanted to do and like everything else. And it's just because I'm holding the pick correctly, you know? If you are used to holding it in a different way and you want to change, it might be annoying. Uh, that's how it was for me. I just, uh, yeah, I just never had someone to really teach me how to do it. And so, yeah, you might find that it's annoying at first, but it's going to be worth it because you're going to find that you'll be able to play all these different things so much more easily. And you're going to run into a lot less roadblocks along the way. I guess if uh, it depends on the kind of style that you play too. Like if you're playing like this and it's totally fine and you're not running to any kind of issues, maybe the style you play is okay <laughs> for that kind of uh, picking technique, you know? If you want to play all different kinds of stuff, like shreddy stuff or whatever, then you might want to change to standard. If you're just starting out, definitely, I would definitely recommend to learn how to pick like this. It's just going to save so much time and energy and frustration. You won't have to change picking styles once you realize that the thing that you've been doing is not very good. Uh, so anyway, yeah, I hope this helped. I know there's a lot of videos that are like this out there already. But I just feel like there needs to be as many as possible just so uh, people don't run into the same kind of issues that I did. Because it's really frustrating, like trying to change your picking style over and over again. It's like, what the hell? So anyway, hope that helped. Thanks. See ya.